We're here with James Agosi, this year's Florida Winter Tour Mini Rock Champion. James, you got in last week and you raced in the Autumn Trophy. You got into the B main there. You weren't as quick as you'd like to, but you've made up a lot of time since last week, haven't you? Yeah, I mean, I've just been learning the track more because this track is one of those tracks where it takes a couple of days to start getting the hang of it. And last week I mixed with some bad luck and some rain. Just wasn't that fast, but this week throughout the heats I've been showing improvements. Yeah, now you're within two tenths, I think, of the leaders. You've made it up to fifth, sixth, and seventh in your heats with one more heat left. What are you, uh, what are you looking forward to tomorrow? Are you going to make any changes overnight to your Tony cart? Well, we're going to get some data, see what, how straight away it was in RPMs. And um, tomorrow I think the plan is just keep a top five finish for the heat. And uh, in the final, just start top 20, hopefully, and get, get top 10. Right, good luck tomorrow, James. Thank you very much. Joey, you've made it through four heat races now, uh, varying results. Somewhere, you were third in one heat, all the way back to 10th in one heat. Um, how are you guys uh, moving forward? What are you guys working on to get faster in your last heat race tomorrow? For me, the big thing is, is me. I feel the cart and the engine are fine, and both are working really, really well. As we've gone purple in our final two heats consecutively, so it shows my equipment's good. Just need to send it a little bit more than I am. <laughs> and you, you've had a full, um, a full season of CIK races over here. Has that helped you prepare for this race? Oh, for sure. Um, when I came over here, I really didn't know what to expect at the start of the year. Um, and it was crazy. Just, as soon as I got on track, everything I had to learn was crazy. From a new way of passing as to America, to just a new way of driving with the tires and the engines. And I kept hearing, oh, second year is going to be better. And I'm like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know the first part's going to be bad. But I want to make the second part good. I don't want to wait for the second year. So. For sure I feel this is a better race and especially last weekend was quite okay as well so I feel just keeping better or getting better as I go. 2019 is right around the corner I think you're going to try for another full season in Europe is that the goal? That's the goal for sure. Um, not really sure what my plans are with car racing. Uh, I don't think so for next year. Hopefully carts that's what I would like. Uh, but yeah I think we're moving into senior next year doing the full CIK schedule and uh, Let's see what happens. It's going to be fun. Good luck tomorrow on your final heat race. Thank you.